greatest misnomer on defense is that the offense dictates and the defense reacts. A good defense knows where they want the ball to go and where they don't want the ball to go. Not only does a great defense know where they want the ball to go, they structure their defense to get it there. One of the things that a great defense does to get the ball where they want it to go is they use ball pressure to force the player with the ball to go where they want them to. Oh, 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 oh. In order to do this, the player guarding the ball has to first be in the offensive player's space and make them uncomfortable enough that they want to get away from them. The next thing that the defense has to do is take away passes that would relieve that pressure. With these two elements of the defense in place, next the player guarding the ball has to force the player with the ball to dribble in the direction that they want. The defender does this by locking up the foot in the direction that they want to take away. We lock up a foot by placing our high foot, the one in the direction that we're trying to take away, past the offensive player's foot in that direction. By doing this, we establish defensive possession and only give the offensive player two options. Either they retreat with their dribble to free themselves from the defensive pressure, or they go in the direction we want them to. Get your high foot above your opponents to force them in the direction you want them to go. All right, I hope you found that 60 second lesson helpful and can use it to improve your game. If you did, hit that like and subscribe button down there and visit mybasketballteacher.com to become a student of the game.